Well, how's everybody doing? Sal Capano here. Yes, I'm smoking a cigar. So for you cigar smokers, um, I'm smoking a Gloria Cubana. <clears throat> it's not on my top 10 list, but I'm going to say it's on the 10 to 15 list. If you're new to my channel, <clears throat> consider on uh, subscribing to my channel. Um, as of late, I've been keeping people up with the latest updates and money tips and POA in particular in Nevada. Uh, and some ups and downs and um so and um if you've been subscribing welcome back more from me so in the morning you see me with a cup of coffee occasionally at night you might see me with a cigar so it's a gloria cabana uh it's a uh good smoke uh they say full body but like everybody who smokes out there i know it's kind of dark out here but it, it's a dark cigar actually um it's a, probably a medium body a little bite to it it changes flavors maybe two times uh, and then of course at the end a little strong but um let's see what i get out of it um i i kind of like it. it's actually a sweet tip interesting <coughs> i didn't do that on purpose either see you're trying to talk and smoke hopefully he's got a little laugh out of that <coughs> Woo! um when i say sweet tip it's not like an acid cigar not that there's anything wrong with acids a lot of you like them it's not sweet like all the way through it's just a sweet tip okay so uh, that's what I'm smoking. The ash isn't real good, but that doesn't mean anything. So I ordered a a Jetline lighter, man, because I'm cheap. I'll use these lighters and I leave them out, man. I mean, these lighters, I mean, let's just look at them on my table. Just leave them out here. Look at that. I got pliers to get them going. You know, it's like, uh, anyhow, I got this Jetline. And, uh, man, these Jetlines are nice. And, well, they are nice. You can't even open them. Look at that. Okay, so here we go. I just like looking at that. Look at that. I <laughs> keep it high. What do you want from me? And then it's got a uh, a little um, punch here that comes out. Let's see here. I like used care, right? <laughs> Anyhow, I got this Jetline on uh, a good good price, man. It, on a cigar auction, uh, I think it was like eleven dollars and fifty cents. So I got a whole bunch of cigars coming. So I'm gonna have a little giveaway soon. Um. So, any ideas how, how I want to give this gift? I'm going to give out a nice cigar. Um, and um, I was thinking about doing like a... Uh, um, I was hoping I can go live and we do like an ash contest. So, um, you know, longest ash. We, I used to be in a cigar club and we did that. But uh, um, I want to think, anybody, leave your comments, you cigar smokers, on uh, what do you think is the best way. Uh, just have some fun. So, uh, you know, uh, a nice little giveaway. Uh, I'll uh, I'll send it in the mail the winner the next day. You want for mail? Put it in a little bag. We'll get it there. Ain't gonna be priority mail. It'll be regular mail. But you know, depending on where you live at, you should get it. So think of uh, a good little contest that I should have. Maybe a trivia question, something that came up. Uh, not everybody follows sports. That wouldn't be fair. Um, maybe we'll just do something with cigars, and then um, you know, maybe we'll just go over. I was thinking, like, what's my top five list? And I'll say it, and then say everybody's paying attention. I don't know. So that's that. So um, anyhow, uh, so, yeah, the 46th president uh, is in. And uh, I said it before, um, whether you support him or not, you know, I was always taught as a young kid, whether you didn't like or you didn't, you didn't support him or not, it, it's, it's a special day. It's a 46th president. It's history. And we don't want to lose the history. We want to make sure our kids would always know history. So, um, but you guys... You know, I, I am not here to tell you what to do, but um, one of the things uh, that he wants to do is um, increase minimum wage to $15 an hour. Um, I'm just making a comment, and uh, some states that'll be real good, other states, you know, where it's real expensive, you know. But, uh, you know, uh, he's also, I said this before with the uh, stimulus package, that's pretty confident that that's going to pass. Um, but, I said, this, I keep saying this, and you say, well, wait a minute, this guy got kids in college. All my kids are all doing well, um, successful. They're not going to college. I do have one family member out there who has a, a smart young lady, but it's not right for kids that are living at home, particularly in this pandemic, and they don't get a stimulus check because they're under their parents or whatever, and they're going to college. I, that there, I'm sorry. I, I hopefully that this administration gets that done. That was one of the things um, that I, I wasn't happy about with the last decision on the on the parties, um, Republican Democrats, and the president getting it done. Um, so let's hope that gets done. Got a haircut tonight. What do you think of that? Look at that little part there to the side. 
I ain't covering up the gray tonight. I'll let it go. The one from a 54. Some people say you put the dark. Oh, one guy says, oh, you look 20 years younger with dark hair. Who are you for? Who are you for? I might look five years younger. Anyhow, my wife. Yeah, for 54, I'm hanging in here with some hair. All right, so uh, let me know what you're smoking tonight on this uh, Wednesday. Uh, leave your comments below. Maybe you're not smoking at all. Maybe you stopped smoking. <laughs> all right, uh, so... Uh, Oh, I, I do want to mention one more thing. I promise it would be mostly cigars. I just wanted to add this in this video. Um, if, if you guys uh, hopefully are still on this video with POA. There's been, um, I've heard just today that a uh, uh, adjudicator told, uh, told me, he was telling me that uh, there was some, um, uh, this weekly claim, there's been some glitches. So if you've seen your account go to zero, it doesn't mean it's done. As long as your credits are showing enough for the remaining of the year, it was a glitch in the system, and uh, they're working on it, and uh, they're hoping they can make a uh, pay it out tomorrow. Remember, refresh everybody's memory on them playing with this because of the Martha Luther King's holiday. Instead of payment date Tuesday, it was Wednesday. So they're going to try to get it out tomorrow. If not tomorrow, you'll get paid next week, the way I understand, for this week and then your following week if you uh, uh, file a weekly claim. So... Um, a glitch in the system. What do you want from me? That's what they're telling me. Um, I heard it was just more than 10 people. It was more like in the hundreds. So, uh, you know, these things happen. So, um, I'm just glad on there. Hopefully, the state of Georgia, um, they're starting to um, pay it out a little bit. And uh, some other states. I did mention in my videos that I, I, I think I said they're going to extend unemployment to uh, $400, so $100 more until probably August or in September. So one of the things, the presidents have like three agendas. Sorry for the noise in the, in the background, but I live in a, 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 where there's a street behind me. It used to be good, quiet, but anyhow, they're, they're, uh, they have three agendas that they, um, they they like to get done right away, all presidents. Uh, you might agree, you might disagree, but one of them is the stimulus. and. Uh, and there's other couple of the green, um, some other things they want to work on. So, um, you know, that's up to you. You guys can leave the comments on that. But uh, uh, just to make you laugh, well, not laugh. Yeah, you can laugh. So every president, when they're our last day, so president um, or former, I guess we'll say formal President Trump. So I apologize for you. Formal President Trump, they leave a note in a desk. Um, every president does it. And... Uh, some call it a joke or some call it a, just a little motivation to the next president and apparently trump left his note and uh in that desk so uh, and uh, joe biden did not want to mention what it was because trump and him decided to keep it quiet for now but he did say it was very positive and was very respectful from the former president donald trump um i'm not taking sides i'm just telling you what the, the media is reporting so uh or what biden's saying uh, president Biden so uh, each president does it so it's just a little motivation funny thing whatever in a, in a drawer so uh, they sit there these presidents and they light up a cigar let me be president because here's what I would do and I'm going to end this video we got to see it. I want to see an Italian president before I die I mean I, okay so we've seen two Catholic presidents I'm Catholic not that it matters I want to see an Italian president can you imagine Imagine me as president. I would kick back like I am now. I would say, I would look in that drawer. So I'd be like, that'd be the first thing. Let's see if they left me any fazools, any money in that drawer. But I, I would look in that drawer and I'd read that letter. Boy, it better. I take stuff very personal. Not just kidding. I'd read that first. I light up a fucking cigar, okay? And uh, I would light up a cigar. I lock that door. I tell my secretary. I tell all the. Leave me alone for an hour. Let me take this all in before I get to work. Because, boy, I would work. Just give me an hour. I would light up the biggest cigar, the most expensive cigar. With my money. I mean that. All right, go. Forget about it. I would, I'm the man. I'm in charge. How about we bring the mob back? I'm just kidding. I, but I, you would be you. Oh, I would love it. And I would say, hey, I want to give me the best vodka you have and a splash of grapefruit juice. Or better yet, give me some, I'm not picky. Give me a little crystal champagne, just a little bit. 
Forget the VSGs. Give me the, give me a thought. Oh, my. bring, bring the cigars. And by the way, bring the Democrats in, bring the Republicans in, and I would say, let me tell you, this. we're gonna have some, we're gonna have some uh, problems. We're gonna occur, and I'm gonna tell you right now, we're gonna get them, we're gonna get them done, and we're gonna get it done, and nobody, everybody's gonna leave here, not hungry. But when you're Italians, I'd make sure there's sausage and peppers, raviolis, a little cannolis for dessert. And everybody be happy, right? Make everybody happy. I get shit done. Everybody be happy. Coffee? Decaf if you don't want coffee? Oh, come on. Italian president before I die. I don't want any fights or brew to tang. One of those that want to be. I was all 100%. And Sicilian. No, I'm just kidding. I'm 90% Sicilian. 10%. I would be great. I don't think you're going to see it. I don't know. What do you guys think? All right, uh, it's getting a little dark. I want from me. I don't like a lot of light. Uh, say hello to somebody. Subscribe to this video. Share this video. A little something different tonight. I told you I'd be back with the cigars. Um, hit the like button. I already said that, right? Yeah, hit the like button again. Keep hitting it. <laughs> Keep hitting that like button. Um, and uh, one day at a time, people. All joking aside. All right. Um, I'll bring you up to date if there's any information on uh, if I hear anything. I doubt you're going to hear anything tomorrow with stimulus package. But everybody have a great night. Be safe. And uh, may God bless you and your family. Stay away. Don't let the politics eat you up. It's not good for you. Thank you, President.